Well, okay. So, I'm making a YouTube show and an Instagram TV show. And I've got at least two other Instagram pages. And I've got one up, man. And, 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 and. And I want to be a social media coach and so much other stuff. I'm going to clip this out um, for a lot of my other content. This is the uh, impromptu studio. I need to get some better lighting. I, I'm really not super happy with it, but I think it's a good start. So I'm not going to worry too much about what I'm doing or why I'm doing it. I'm just going to do it. This is a lot of fun for me to do, and I've wanted to do it for a long time. I just never had the right framework and perception to do it. Now I look at stuff uh, as I've got to do it for myself first. And when I was younger, I think I used to want to make YouTube videos and make videos for people um, to watch and get like crazy views. And I remember seeing like the first couple videos with like a million views. Now everybody's like, there's tons of people who get like tons of views. This is all about me just like not caring, doing it my way and then clipping it out into fun little factual clips. I've got my, my kind of like show notes my trusty iPad and uh, and yeah, so it's it's just gonna be a lot of fun. I'm actually gonna make it to those 5,000 subscribers, which is like my my goal right now. That's my goal. I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna get there and I'm gonna push and I'm gonna push and I'm gonna push until I've got my content and my, my, my stuff that game, I just gotta keep doing it. I think I've been doing pretty good on posts. Uh, I started a capital cards and games page on Instagram and that's connected to my capital cards and games page which I've had for a long time and then I've got my boss results group page I just linked that up this morning and I've been posting really in-depth content I wanted to explain to people like what the pictures meant to me and hopefully start to gain some like organic traffic and I'm really actually excited about that. Like even just today, I've gotten a ton of traffic, a ton of likes, ton of just random people. I haven't linked it to any of my friends, groups or anything. I'm just purely practicing what I've been learning about how to uh, engage with Instagram and how to get my photo descriptions and stuff working well. So when you're editing your Instagram posts, what I've learned in the last couple of weeks is it's very important to be very descriptive of your event, whatever you're posting. The better um, and more in-depth you go with the description, just your general description, uh, make it authentic and, and talk about exactly how you're feeling when you're doing it or what it means to you. Those sorts of things um, are very good to build your community. And then on top of that, I've been learning a lot about the hashtags and how to really leverage my hashtags. I used to, like when I started, I was posting in the most popular hashtags because I was looking like, oh, this has got 200 million subs, you know, like lots of people, lots of traffic through it. But you're going to get lost in that content and you, you, you need to start niche. So rather than posting just like Pokemon, I'm posting like Pokemon booster packs or Pokemon art or really cool Pokemon action figures or stuff like that and you'll see in the hashtag like when you put up a hashtag it'll say like how many followers are in that hashtag and it'll be like a lower amount like you'll see like 50,000 or, or whichever so hashtagging is important uh, hashtag your stuff in lower hashtags and mix it up don't always use the same hashtags so Today, I'm opening a sh uh, Burning Shadows Sun and Moon pack. I'm still trying to get that Charizard. So, here we go. Let's do it quick. I gotta do it within a minute. And make that Instagram post nice and fast. Okay. Um, sorry, I can't show this. I'm gonna learn how to show this better. I got a Porygon Z. A little disappointed. Not the Charizard I wanted, but there's still some really cool cards. Guzma was really big when, uh, when this came out. Um, yeah, I love the energy cards in this series. Uh, they really pop. And that is the pack. No GXs, unfortunately. Oh, I need better lighting. So if anybody has any ideas, I'm, I, this is like really ad hoc right now. I've got like stuff over lights and I've got like a weird back 
front light thing. I think it looks pretty decent with what I have. Um, so I need, I need better lights. Um, mass content, I kind of touched on that. Uh, building my audience. Obviously, I'll be pushing the Cloverdale market more. Um, I've been getting lots of traffic through there, getting the local community in buying and selling and getting involved in my journey. So I, I really want to make this into a documentation of my journey in life in general. And it's varied. If you know me, you know I, I, I put my, I, I go all over the place. I, I'm, I'm very wide in my scope of like what I'm interested in. So that makes for good content and stuff. Like. I'm, I've, I'm, I'm really into construction, as you guys see on my One Up Man page. I, I do pipe laying and uh, just general all sorts of different construction projects. Right now, I'm working with machines and 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 like the underground stuff, putting in water mains and and uh, d just all these interesting interesting pieces of tech that are underground that people don't really get to see. So, look forward to seeing me post like more on that uh, coming up. So I'll probably be doing a couple other projects um, and I'm gonna be working with how I can roll that content out and also how I can just like produce more of it because so far I've only been able to do a little bit at a time when I have free time. So I, I'd like to make that bigger, maybe GoPro, something like that would be interesting. Um, I'm having a lot of fun curating boss results. It's, it's, it's a blast for me. Uh, I want I want to get prints going so that boss results can have prints of all my all my good photography and I think I'll be bringing that to the market as well so I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna do a quick video for the market so the Cloverdale market has been one of the most consistent things in my life for the past three years. I, I took a break uh, to have Isabel and that was fantastic but now I'm looking to take it up a notch and I, I have a huge community of people who really love our engagement at the market and I want to make it bigger. So I'm not going this weekend because it's a long weekend. I don't do long weekends. So next, uh, the next weekend I do go, I want to have posters done and hopefully a little bit more of a media setup, maybe a tablet, something people can engage with to get that Instagram and that like followership base going. So that's my goal. I'm gonna make posters, guys. They're gonna be good and I'm gonna have lots. And I got that whole top space. If you've seen me at the market, I have tons of space up there and I'm gonna keep doing market content too. So expect a lot, of, a lot from me there. Um, <clears throat> I'm working on eBay. Uh, I'm actually going to be doing some posts after this, throwing up some cards on eBay, some of my Gen 1 Pokemon. It's stuff of the slow movers at the market. Sometimes they go really quick on eBay. And I'm designing a few like Pokemon surprise packs as well. So that will be good. Mm. Well, it really looks like I've gotten through just about everything. I'd really love to hear any sort of remarks you guys have, what I could do better, uh, any ideas about other content I could be leveraging. I think I'll be getting onto Twitter pretty soon. Uh, definitely doing the YouTube starting up really, really soon. And I'm gonna be developing my, my studio, like this little stuff around me and make it look interesting. Hopefully I can do a couple box openings and, and fun things like that, because honestly, I like to talk, and if you know me, I can talk a lot. Probably, probably more than half half the people care to hear. But I'm stoked that I'm finally getting into it, and this is this is a lot of fun. So, uh, just a closing remarks: just make stuff. That's my that's my that's what I'm pushing. Just just make stuff, and we will. Um, I'll be doing lots of these. So don't worry, you won't miss a thing. I'll probably repeat myself a hundred times on all of this sort of stuff. And let's see what kind of content I can kind of remix out of this. Uh, have a good day and, 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 you know, and just make stuff. Just make stuff. Bye.